battery's not coming off. Why ain't it coming off? No, that's not coming off. Why ain't that coming off? <laughs> Hi guys and welcome back to another nail video. So I'm going to start off this one by showing you what products I'm using and this nice and neat. It took me ages to do this but you know it's all worth it. Today's video is inspired by these Louis Vuitton stickers that I've got. Now I know I've never done anything like this before, anything themed like this. I have got no clue where I've got these from, it doesn't say. If I can remember where I got them from I will definitely tell you in the description box. So the other items I'm using, all these are from Neo. different things out of different things like this. Now these are supposed to be like this, like dome type things, but if you turn them over, they've got a really cool effect on with the power, power, power shell. I'm just gonna call them power. So I'm gonna be using them as well. Nope. And I've got some silver foil. I know it's got blue in it, but I'll just try and avoid that some beads this i'm going to use for my nail bed and other things and this is called cotton candy from Nao. these two are from phoenix glitter from their candy collection and it's just uh, the two dots that i showed you in last week's video i think and i think i'm going to be using glam gold from Nao. no on my other nails so i'm not putting this stuff on i'm going to be using madame glam's perfect black I am going to sculpt my nails, so I'm going to use these from Neo again. Okay, so I will just go ahead and prep this hand anyway, and then I'm going to start off by putting the nail forms on. Then I'm going to prep my thing, my nail bed, should I say. Then I'm going to put a thin layer of clear over the nail beds before I start anything else. All right, instead of just doing my nail bed, I'm just gonna sculpt out my nail because I want most of them clear anyway. So I'm just gonna sculpt the nail out and then I can take these ridiculously long nail forms off because <laughs> you can't do anything with them on. But just to let you know, I did already um, get the cuticle remover and just do all that bit, them, them bits before I turn the camera on. Uh, I do that in every video, so if you watch, watch me a lot, then you'll know exactly what I do before I start putting acrylic on.
they took five minutes to do so it's always nice when you take these off oh god it feels so lovely I have had some nail forms that um, I'm allergic to and I get spots from believe it or not it must be the glue that's on them that I don't like but yeah they're a nice length so now all I'm going to do is to file them into shape and then I'll be back Okay, so I've filed all them. With my ring finger and thumb, I'm going to put, no, uh, the jet black on. I'm just gonna do it now and cure it and stuff, just so them two nails are done, because as I said, the, the Louis Vuitton things are going on there. So I'm going to get the Nao's base coat and I'm going to put that over both of these nails. And then I'm going to apply the, maybe one or two coats of black, cure it. And then for now, that nail is done. Okay, so I've just changed my mind. I'm gonna get the bottom of that off. So I'm gonna get some pure acetone. Okay, so I can always tidy it up, but it's not coming off. Why ain't it coming off? No, that's not coming off. Why is that coming off? Looks like I'm gonna have to file it off. Oh well, at least it's only two nails. So I'm not gonna ruin my well, anything, because it's black gel polish at the end of the day. I'm going to use one of these sand bands, because, yeah, I did make a little bit of a boo-boo, but never mind. At least it's savable. Okay, so with my other nails, I'm going to put the cotton candy on like a bit of a nail bed, but I'm going to stop it going as a nail bed, if you know what I mean. You'll see what I mean when I get there, just so it's got a flat edge. And then I'm going to leave most of the nail clear, and I think I am going to put a bit of the cotton candy at the bottom of the nail and then do the same thing. But apart from that, and I've never done anything this logo famous, I want to say, um, but yeah, I'm really hoping these turn out well. Alright, so I've done what I've got to do with them. What I'm gonna how I'm gonna apply the, the the gold things, I'm going to leave these out by the way, because I don't think these will go. To apply the gold bits and the foil and stuff, I'm gonna put some top coat on these three nails and then put them on. And I'm not sure whether I'm gonna put a little bit of pink on the bottom yet. I really don't know. I think I might, but I'll see how these go first.
All right, now them are done. I'm going to put a little bit of the cotton candy down on the bottom of them three nails. Then I'm going to encapsulate them and then we can see what we're going to do next. Okay, so I just want to say that I am going to put something different on tomorrow night, which is Sunday. And it's to do with the design that I'm doing now. It's something I've wanted to do for a long time and I finally plucked the courage up to do it. When you watch the video, you will have to let me know if you like it or not. I won't be doing this all the time. It is just an experiment. And if you do like what I'm gonna do, then I'll do the odd one more. You'll find out tomorrow when you see it, but yeah, I'm quite excited about how you, how you feel about tomorrow's video. Okay, for, so for the next part, I'm going to get the black and gold striping tape. I've got some scissors from Natasha Lee. They're really good ones, they are, by the way. Um, and these stickers, these are from Model Ones, by the way. I had a load of them. So I'm just going to decide where I want these stickers on both of them, these black nails. Um, and then I'm going to put them on with one of Natasha Lee's tweezers. Everything's sticky, so I don't need anything else. But yeah, I'll get on with these. And then after that, I'm gonna stick these little gem things on. No. Nope. And then top coat. Okay, so for the black nails, now I've finished them, I'm going, for the clear part at the bottom of the nail, I'm going to put some matte top coat, and then over the rest of the nail, I'm going to put Wow Bow's High Shine top coat, and I'm hoping that looks okay.
All right guys, so I've just put some cuticle oil on and that is my finished Louis Vuitton design. I've got to say, I love these nails. They are amazing. I don't mean to praise myself because most of them were done with stickers, so. <laughs> love the effect that I've put the matte top coat on the end of these and I've also put it underneath as well, so it's totally matte. But yeah, I would love to know what you think of these nails, guys, and the things that I've put inside them. If there's anything else I forgot, I will also leave that in the description box. But thank you so much for watching this one, guys. Take care wherever you are in the world, and I hope to see you next time. Bye, guys.